Crew Earth observations have long been the way the astronauts get to see our planet, and we've uh, benefited from the photographs they've been able to share with us, but taking a photo while traveling 17,500 miles an hour can be a little tricky. NASA commentator Lori Meggs is at the Payload Operations Integration Center in Huntsville, Alabama, to show us one of the tools that helps astronauts take those photos, allowing students, scientists, and the public to explore Earth from space. Earth Day is approaching. It's a time when many of us take the day to appreciate our beautiful planet and learn how to protect it. Well, astronauts on the space station get to take in that beauty every day from the unique vantage point of space. And lucky for us, they share that through photos. I spoke with Dan Barstow, the principal investigator for Windows on Earth, which is a tool that gives them a little help in snapping the best shots. Windows on Earth helps the astronauts do Earth observation and photography. The astronauts take amazing pictures of Earth. I don't know if you've ever seen any of them, <laughs> but they are just gorgeous. They show the Sahara, the Nile River, the Beijing at night, the Aurora. They're just so compelling and engaging. Our software helps them identify the targets to photograph and disseminates them to the public. The astronauts enjoy taking pictures. You can just imagine them looking out the window, seeing the day and night and all the different things that they see. Some of the pictures they take are just because it's fun, they like to see it and they, you know, great pictures. But when they have scientific targets, it's often hard to identify exactly the object that they're looking for. So our software helps them by simulating a view out the window so they know exactly what they're looking at and can, there it is, click, take the picture. So for the astronauts perspective, they actually helped, we work directly with the astronauts in designing this software, so it's really a tool more for them than it is for us. So they certainly appreciate getting this kind of extra visual. Yeah, because I would think going 17,000 miles an hour, not a lot of time to really think and look and You've really no. got to be quick with it. Yeah. Just imagine you're flying over, you want to get Boston. You have about 30 seconds for the, uh, that Boston goes by in the window that you have to identify it, frame it, compose it, take the picture, and then get ready for the next one. It, it takes a lot of fast response. So talk about some of the fascinating photographs you've gotten back because of that software. Anything that sticks out? Yeah, we uh, every day, uh, in collaboration with NASA, they download the images, then we process them and post them on our public website, which is the other part of this project called windowsonearth.org, free public website. We have over 500,000 images in there. Wow. So every day we're processing and I'm looking at these pictures. It's just, it comes from the heart. They are so beautiful. The auroras are always amazing to see on the horizon, the green and the shimmering. Uh, I love seeing the Bahamas. I mean, some of the things that the astronauts really enjoy taking a lot are the, the blues and the aquas of the Bahama Islands or the flying over Cairo and you see the Nile River, just this verdant green wavy line in the middle of the barren desert. So if they go to your website, you can search it, search for yes. a particular place you're looking for? Yes, you can search for any site. You get to see the, all the photographs taken any day. They're posted. You can look through them all. You can pick favorites. You can look for types of features, like a volcano or a hurricane or locations. Why is it so important to get these photographs from space? We live on a wonderful planet. Planet Earth is this oasis in space. The astronauts understand our planet as a whole planet, as an integrated system, all the pieces working together because they, they're able to be away from it, take their 92 minutes as they're going around the Earth, seeing the Earth from this sort of global perspective. The photographs enable the public to experience the same thing. That kind of stepping back and seeing things more clearly is crucial for sustainability on home planet Earth.